this is a road shower. And a road shower is exactly what it sounds like. It's a shower that you take with you on the road. And I'm thinking that every sauna, not only does it need a shower, but it also needs a way to extinguish fires, should that ever occur. And so this is gonna be one of my creature comforts slash, you know, a safety precaution. It's going on the side, on that beautiful rack on the left side of the horse trailer. Sticker. This is the, the nozzle that it comes with. And I'm going to attach it to this rack with some carriage bolts. Something like that. What's in here? Ooh, another nozzle. Or a nozzle, rather. go. That'll do. So now we're going to have pressurized water on a hose that can, can be attached hands-free or with a spray nozzle. Just so nobody decides to steal this thing. You can even lock it to this. So typically, if this were a regular road shower, I would leave it completely exposed because the black pipe actually will conduct heat from the sun and heat up the water. So you actually can have a nice warm shower on the road. But because this is for a sauna and will already be hot, I'm thinking it's gonna be better to have cooler water. So we made this little board that's gonna double up as like a little countertop, a bench if you want, and it's also gonna shade the road shower uh, in order to keep the water slightly cooler.
Will it work? I have no idea, but in theory, it sounds awesome. Two nozzles are better than one. One in the front, and then another one in the back. And all road showers come with this little loop, metal loop, so you can secure it. And so it makes it a little bit harder for somebody to steal. Not impossible, but a little bit harder. <laughs> 